Hello everyone. Today we will discuss composite material focusing on their properties, applications, characteristics and classification. Composite materials are engineered material made from two or more materials with, with significantly different physical or chemical properties. But when combined together, they create a material with properties superior to the individual components. Common example for composite material are fiberglass, carbon fiber composite and concrete. Now let's talk about the properties of composite material. Key properties include high strength to weight ratio, which means basically the material is very strong compared to its weight, making it a lightweight yet capable of carrying heavy loads. Composite material offer unique combination of both strong and lightweight, making them highly desirable in industries like aerospace, automotive and sports. They can provide the necessary strength to the handle heavy loads or forces without adding significant weight. This result in improved fuel efficiency in vehicle and enhanced performance in equipment like sport gear. Their high strength to weight ratio makes them ideal for design where minimizing weight is crucial. Second uh, is a corrosion resistant. One of the advantage of many composite material is their ability to resist corrosion, especially when compared to metals like steel or aluminium. This resistant to environmental factor like moisture, chemicals, salt water makes them particularly useful in marine chemical processing and offshore industries. Composite can maintain their integrity and appearance even in harsh environments. Next, thermal stability. Many composite material are designed to remain stable and retain their mechanical properties even under high temperature condition. This thermal stability is crucial for industry like aerospace and automotive when components are exposed to extreme heat such as in uh, engine compartment or during high speed flight. Composite can handle both uh, this demanding condition without losing strength and ensuring safety. Fatigue resistance. Composite have the ability to endure repeated stress without cracking or breaking down, a property known as fatigue resistance basically. This characteristic is, uh, uh, is essential for uh, structures that face continuous or cyclic loading, uh, which is uh, usually observed in uh, aircrafts and turbine blades. Now, uh, let's move to the design flexibility. So composite materials are highly flexible in design, allowing manufacturers to create complex and lightweight shape that are uh, useful and which, can, which cannot be easily achieved by using other materials. Tailored properties. Composite can be customized to meet specific needs by choosing different materials for the base and reinforcing fibers. This allows for the control over key features like strength, heat resistance, weight, etc. As a result, engineer can create material designed exactly for particular job such as lightweight aircraft parts or, or rust resistant uh, marine equipment. Now. Let's, durable, uh, let's discuss uh, uh, the durability. Composite materials are very durable and can withstand tough conditions like corrosion, repeated, uh, repeated stress, impact and harsh weather. This makes them the uh, useful for long lasting use in demanding condition like uh, airplane, wind turbine, ship, etc. Now let's discuss about the application of composite material. We already mentioned about the application uh, application of composite material while discussing the properties of composite material. But let's discuss in detail. Uh, the composite materials are used in variety of industries such as aerospace. In aerospace, uh, composite materials are vital for aircraft structure, helicopter rotor blades, and satellite components due to their strength and lightweight properties. This help uh, in improving fuel efficiency and performance while withstanding extreme temperature and resisting corrosion. 
uh, in uh, automotive industry as well uh, composite are used in lightweight body panels chassis components and brake system their reduced weight improves fuel efficiency and vehicle performance while providing excellent crash resistance and durability for safer and long lasting vehicles similarly in construction industry in con construction con construction industry composite materials are used uh, due to their high strength and corrosion resistance and uh, design flexibility which makes them ideal and durable and long lasting infrastructure which can withstand harsh condition and allow for innovative architectural designs similarly in uh, in sports industries composite are essential in manufacturing sports product like tennis racket bicycle and golf clubs their lightweight are uh, yet strong properties improve control speed and precision uh, uh, composite material are also used in marine uh, uh, in marine industries uh, composites are used in boats decking and un underwater structures due to their resistance to water and corrosion these properties makes them uh, ideal for long term durability in harsh ocean condition uh, composite material are also used in renewable energy industries uh, in in wind turbine blades and, and solar panel supports for their lightweight uh, strength and durability this help uh, wind turbines operate efficiently and ensure solar panel structures remain stable in, in varying environmental conditions now let's study and let's talk about characteristics of composite material one of the characteristics is anisotropy anisotropy basically describes how materials proper how materials property uh, such as uh, strength or thermal conductivity vary with the directions unlike isotropic materials which have uniform properties in all the directions composite can be engineered with specific orientation of fibers to enhance strength in particular direction not in all the direction but in some particular direction this feature is particularly valuable in aerospace industries where material must withstand various forces allowing for lightweight and high strength structure tailored for optimal performance uh, tailored properties a significant advantage of composite material is the ability to customize their properties to meet specific engineering needs by adjusting the prop proportions and types of materials constituent materials engineers can design composite that exhibit desired characteristics such as strength stiffness flexibility etc environmental resistance composite uh, uh, composite material uh, demonstrate excellent resistance to the environmental factors including ultraviolet light moisture chemical etc this makes them ideal for application exposed to harsh condition such as outdoor structures and marine environment uh, long life span many composite materials are designed for durability and uh, which results in uh, in the extended service life that minimizes the need for replacement their resistance to wear and environmental damage contributes to long lifespan making them a cost effective choice in various applications from infrastructure to automotive components composite uh, material reduces the life cycle cost while enhancing the reliability and sustainability uh, now let's talk about the classification of composite material composite materials are basically classified into broadly classified into three categories first one is particulate composite laminar composite and fiber reinforced composite particulate composites are made by mixing small particles or fillers into a matrix which may consist of polymers metals or ceramics these fillers serve to enhance properties such as strength toughness and thermal resistance particulate composite can be used in construction and automotive sectors the size and distribution uh, pattern of particles can be done precisely to achieve specific mechanical and physical characteristics now let's come to the laminar composite laminar composite are composed of multiple layers 
like this these are the layers different layers are composed of multiple layers called as laminates they may be of different material having different properties which are all bonded together to form a single structure these layers are typically made from different materials such as polymers metals or ceramics and can be oriented in various direction to optimize strength and performance lamina composite are commonly used in aerospace structures automotive components and sporting materials where lightweight yet strong materials are essential the specific arrangement and thickness of each layer can be customized to meet requirement of particular application now let's come to now let's discuss the fiber reinforced composite fiber reinforced composite are made by combining strong fibers for example carbon or glass with some base material such as plastic or metal here fiber uh, basically provides strength and stiffness while the base holds them together and these materials are lightweight but strong making them useful in applications related to airplanes cars and its sports products these uh, fibers can be arranged to give strength in a particular direction depending upon the requirement that's it for today thank you